good morning and happy Saturday, start of the week for the vlog, and <clears throat> it is 7.45 in the morning. I am heading out over to the church that we use the hall to do the breakfast with Santa with, and um, I'm getting there early. It starts at 9, I'm getting there at 8 in order to help set up and get everything ready, um, since I'm on the committee for that. And Marty is going to bring MJ and my mom over to breakfast. So we're just heading over there. I don't know how much I will have a chance. Not as much that I'm worried about showing, but I don't know how much I'll have a chance to show just because I think it's going to be a little crazy because we have to set the whole place up within an hour. And you know people always show up early, so we'll see. Yeah. 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 Save another spot over there for <laughs> So I am on my way back home and the event was amazing. We had so many people, it was absolutely crazy. It's 11.30 now and uh, absolutely crazy how busy it was. Um, I'll insert a little bit here of what it looks like when we set up. I did not even have two seconds to tape anything while uh, it was going on because it was so crazy just with everything going on. We had so many people we had to go back out and get more food. Um, but it was good fun, made a lot of money for the group and for charity and all that. And uh, it was really fun for a lot of families, so that's awesome. Uh, heading home to get MJ lunch. Marty and I are gonna go look at a couple cars today, go test drive a couple cars he wants me to see. Um, the two Lexus, the Mercedes, something else. I don't remember what the third one, fourth one is. There's one other one. Anyway, gonna go test drive those. And uh, then my mom and I are going to bake our cookies that we bake every year uh, together. They're just basic like um, press cookies. Uh, so we're gonna bake those this afternoon. And then tonight, I am going to sit on my butt and do nothing. I am exhausted, tired. I don't think we have anything tomorrow, which is nice, because I could use a day of just kind of relaxing. Uh, so I will try and take some little bits and pieces. I obviously won't while I'm test driving cars, because I won't have like my uh, thing, but uh, maybe while we're making cookies or something like that. Good morning, all. It is Sunday. I just got out of the shower. It's about 10 o'clock. Um, I just got out of the shower and got ready. My hair is still wet. Um, I'm getting ready to do some laundry, edit my vlog, and Marty and MJ are at the gym right now. I didn't get a chance to go this morning. I needed to get some things done. I'm super behind. All of a sudden, if you watch my beauty videos, I realized the other day I had my I had taped and edited my makeup graveyard blushes, but I totally forgot to put the links in. So I need to sit down and do all the links for that today so you guys have it. Um, and uh, yesterday we went and looked at cars, kind of narrowed it down uh, between, we. I was very, very, very shocked. I really liked the Mercedes. I was really shocked because I'm not usually a Mercedes fan at all. Uh, the Lexus was nice. I liked it. The BMW was fine. I'm just okay on BMWs. I'm not, <clears throat> we've had a lot of BMWs and I'm not a big fan of them. I just think they're okay. Uh, Mercedes, I've never been a fan of, but I kind of went because his mom just got a new ML um, and she really loved it. And she was there, she, her dad, his dad and mom were both like, you guys would really love this. So we went to look at that and the GL. Honestly, they're my two top front runners right now. Um, they're really nice. The GL I think is too big though. Like we really don't need that much space, but it's the one with a third row, but I don't really have to have a third row. I just like having a third row. So um, it is what it is, we'll figure it out. We're just kind of still working on the specs. Marty wants like the higher end one of them. So it's finding the right one and the right color collect colors that I want and all that. So it is what it is, came home, ended up getting home late. So we did not make cookies with my mom. And there was something else we were gonna do last night that we didn't end up doing. Cookies and then something else, I don't know. I don't remember what I said we were gonna do. We were gonna do cookies and something and we didn't end up doing any of it because <clears throat> we got home, it was closer to four o'clock. So we ended up just hanging out 
uh, playing and hanging out and picked up some food. And Marty and I just watched some more Sons of Anarchy last night. I'm addicted to that show. We are already on season two and we just started watching it this week. It's insane. It's so good. Um, it's like Breaking Bad. You just couldn't kind of put it down. So now I'm going to go edit some videos and uh, do some uh, links. God, I can't think today. Do some laundry. I probably can see Diesel laying back there. I've got some laundry to do back there. I'm going to do that stuff and then I don't know what we're doing today. Honestly, I think we're just going to have a low-key day So, because I have a bunch of work to get done for uh, videos and uh, I have a lot going on this week coming up. So I think that's gonna be about it for today. I'll take you along where I can. I am on my way to the grocery store. It's uh, about 1.30 on Sunday afternoon and I'm heading to the grocery store while MJ naps, which is the norm. Um, we just ran out for a little lunch after MJ and Marty got back from the gym. Uh, we went to Five Guys. Um, I think they're pretty much all over the place now, but I don't know. Um, they're kind of like this burger place. They are a burger place. It's called Five Guys Burgers and Fries, but they're a burger place that just does really basic like burgers and really good fries and stuff like that. I haven't had one since MJ was in a carrier like an infant carrier so it's been a long long while um we just went there to grab a bite to eat and they have peanuts um and mj loves peanuts uh so i taped a video i'll insert it here of him actually cracking open a peanut he was so proud of himself every time he would crack open a peanut and uh be able to eat the peanut he was really enjoying it so it was kind of funny um and just cute just because i don't think i've ever seen him actually open his own peanut and eat it type of thing so heading to the grocery store we forgot that we had dinner with our neighbors tonight um, they have one of those green egg smokers and they're smoking a turkey and uh, so I'm gonna make mac and cheese and get something for dessert and uh, take that over there to their house tonight and so actually I didn't have to cook I came up with four things for dinner tonight and um, or this week and I thought I needed five and I now only need four because tonight we don't need something. So uh, that's pretty much where we're at, heading into the grocery store in just a second. And uh, I don't think we're doing much else today. So off and running, it is yet another dark and dismal day. Let's see what the temperature is. Oops, wrong. Oh, I hate this one. In Marty's car. And I never remember how to do it. 36 degrees outside. Um, let's see here. Goodness, I uh, already went to the gym this morning. Did not have swim class today. MJ has swim class on Wednesday this week and not, come on buddy, go. Uh, not on Monday, the trainer, not trainer, the uh, instructor is, uh, she had something going on today. I think it was a doctor's appointment or something. So we didn't have class today, but we do have class on Wednesday. Um, to, and Thursday, I have my company lunch holiday dinner thing. Um, I work for a real estate company too. I talk about this in some of my beauty videos, but I don't know if you guys know this too. Um, I also have my real estate license and I hold it with a company called Garso Realty, which is a Maryland based company. I know I'm good friends with the owner and the family and things like that. So um, that is who I work for. I wasn't good friends with them when I started. I became good friends with them after working with the family for a while. Um, and they're awesome. I would change where I work for anything and I can you know with real estate you work for yourself so I work when I want to and I don't when I don't want to but because MJ is little I right now only work with people that I really really know well or a friend that might really need a hand or something like that I don't go out and get like I don't sit in the office and wait for calls to come in or anything like that anymore um, because right now honestly with MJ I'm mostly at home with him um, so I just kind of
got up and went to the gym. Oh, he's talking about Thursday. Went to the gym, came home. My Acura um, was idling a little funny. So I called the dealership, took it in, dropped it off, and I'm driving the Jeep now, and Marty has a rental car. And so um, because Thursday, that's what I was getting to, because I have this luncheon on Thursday, um, and we didn't get to make cookies the other day with my mom, my mom's gonna come down Thursday morning, and we're gonna make cookies Thursday morning. And then I'm going to go to my company luncheon, on Thursday and she's gonna stay with MJ so my sitter is not coming so my sitter is there today which is Monday um, so I can go run some errands I'm gonna go to Nordstrom Rack um, I'm going to return one thing at the mall and then I have to go to let me think I have to go to Home Depot because one of the remotes for our Christmas lights is not working and I put a new battery in it it's still not working so I, the lights that are the candles that are in the windows are on remotes and uh, one of so I'm going to get a new remote for that and then um, what else do I, have to go? Oh, I have to go to Pier 1 Imports. I need to get um, something to go along with the gift. We do a white elephant gift um, at our Christmas party so I have to get some nice little glassware to go with what I got for that and oh I have to go to Party City because we have a Christmas party at our house on November the 19th just for the development and a couple friends. Um, we have a lighting judging of the lights in our development and we're on the committee this year because we won last year to judge the lights of other people because you can't win the year after you won so you then become a judge. So anyway, um, I need to get plastic martini glasses for that um, <clears throat> because we always end up missing some after those parties and it's easier just to have little holiday plastic ones and who cares, throw them away. It's way easier to clean up after too. So I think those are the only things. I had a little list and uh, Home Depot, Pier 1, Party Store. Oh, I was going to go by the, a different Ann Taylor loft, not the one I went to last week. Because sometimes they have different stuff in them and I have an idea. Because I have um, Marty's parents' Christmas party is this weekend on Saturday. Then um, I have the oh, I have the Christmas luncheon on Thursday, then his parents' Christmas party on Friday. The Friday after is our Christmas party, and then I also have New Year's that I have to pan, plan and pack for um, coming out soon. So just trying to get some stuff for that. Uh, on my face today is Marc Jacobs Marvelous Mousse, Lara Mercier Minerals. Um, that same Bare Minerals palette, like quad, no wait, true duo there we go duo called top shelf and I think I'm gonna buy a full size of that because I really really like it um, Mac black track uh, Dior iconic over curl I've been using the Dior star concealer a lot lately and playing with that oh and the Bobby Bat brown like treatment one or brightening one or something underneath um, over there's a cop right there that's a strange place for him to have pulled somebody over unless he hit him Anyway, and uh, lips are NYX. Talia, my lips. And I think that's everything I have on my. Oh, um, cheeks are tart emphasize, I think it's called. No, that's not right. Tart, the one that everybody talked about for a real long while there. That one, and then I put on a Laura Mercier highlighter that is was limited edition, it's no longer sold. Um, so I'm gonna go run my errands, I'll take you guys along as I can. So I'm cooking right now, so it's a little bit loud because I'm cooking some bacon, but uh, hair I ended up pulling back. I have on a J. Crew sweater, or sweatshirt type sweater with the jewels at the top. Um, jeans are Hudson Nico Skinny and my Fry boots. Oops, sorry, that's the thing. Um, everything else is the same as it normally is. So what I was cooking with bacon is I'm making those Brussels sprouts with onions and I'll show you. Basically, bacon, the bacon is over here, already cooked. Brussels sprouts, onions, a little bit of McCormick, steak seasoning, and some red wine vinegar. I don't measure any of it, I just kind of go this way. And we've got chicken in cooking and it's got about 10 minutes left. And my stove is a mess from cooking all this career with all this. Such a mess. 
Today is Tuesday and it is almost two o'clock. MJ is napping. We have been to the gym, came home, had lunch, uh, hung out, and then I got showered, dressed, ready, and I taped a video. Um, and I'm waiting for, we get these American Express points and we cash them in for Neiman Marcus gift cards because I wanted a new pair of those rag and bone booties, the Newberry ones. And since I wasn't buying them at Nordstrom's, figured we would get the points and I'd get the booty boots paid for without, you know, spending real money, so to speak. Um, we placed the order for the gift cards over two weeks ago and every day I'm like, oh good, it'll come in and I'll run today to Neiman Marcus and pick them up. And every day it's not in and it's so annoying because I wanted to take them with me this weekend and it is not gonna happen. So I'm really bummed about that. Um, and so I'm now going to edit a video and hang out while MJ is napping and then we'll see what else we do today. Honestly, Marty's away. Um, I am waiting to hear her back from the vet because Diesel's hips are bothering, some, bothering him. So I think I'm going to up him from the Zoom shoes, which are glucosamine for his joints to uh, the prescription. And he's almost 12. So, you know, I just don't want him in pain. He seems to be uncomfortable right now. He's whining a lot while he lays down. So I don't want it to bother him. So um, that's everything. Just waiting to hear back from the vet. If the vet calls, we'll run down and get his prescription. But other than that, we don't have anything going on today. So we're just hanging out. So after all, MJ and I decided to go down to Tyson's Corner. Long story short, Marty kind of talked to American Express or something. And essentially, I'm gonna go buy the boots because they only have one pair left and, in my size. And I'm gonna go buy them and then when we get the gift cards in they'll credit our American Express for them I guess so what a pain in the butt that's been but anyway so we it's just a dismal day anyway so we weren't going to be doing much else so we are on our way down there and I'm really excited I'm glad they have them in my stock um, I would say fry boots are probably my favorite boots and then rag and bone is probably my other favorite like my second favorite let me rephrase that I like fry boots I like their tall boots like I have um Carmen Harness Tall, and then I have, oh, what's the short one? I have two Carmen Harness Tall. Anyway, I have a bunch of different fry boots. I like them, and then I like the Rag and Bone, but Rag and Bone is hard for me to get a hold of, I guess is why I have an issue with them. They probably, if they were closer to me, I'd, or easier to get a hold of, I'd even like them more. So um, we are heading out to the mall. It is 3.30 now, and we should be there about 4.28, it says in the navigation. And uh, so, it's gonna take us a little while, but I'm just hoping, ugh, and I know I'm not gonna be right on this, I'm hoping that uh, we don't hit any traffic on our way back home, but five o'clock traffic from DC is just nasty no matter which way you look at it. We get there at 4.30 and we stay and we eat dinner and things like that. We are still gonna hit traffic on our way back. Um, my friend Susan, who's here on YouTube, who I talked to here on YouTube, um, is in Tyson's Corner and I'm sure she's laughing at me right now because she knows no matter what I do, I'm gonna be stuck in traffic leaving Tyson's Corner anytime from four o'clock to six o'clock, you're just gonna sit. 495 from DC, gotta love it. So we are heading out there now and I will catch up with you guys when I can. It is Wednesday morning and we are not going to the gym today, surprisingly enough, um, because I had to go pick up Diesel's medicine last night. It took us way longer to get home than I expected. Um, so we got home, literally, he ate on the way home. Sure, you want some juice? Uh, we ate on the way home, or he ate on the way home, I ate when we got home, um, and uh, then literally we got home and walked upstairs and put him to bed, and then I ate something. So um, I will show you the shoes I got in a little bit, uh, we're just out. We had to run down, it's like 20 minutes from our house to Diesel's vet to pick up his prescription, because they were closed last night by the time we got by. Um, I don't know if I told you, I called the vet to see... Um, if I could get, uh, they're giving him a, not a pain med, an anti-inflammatory for his hips and he stays on the glucosamine. So maybe that way it'll help it out versus putting him on a pain medicine because the problem with pain medicines with dogs, especially big dogs, any dog actually, is that um, they can't then tell you when something else is wrong or bothering them. So we're trying to avoid putting him on a pain medicine, but I don't want him uncomfortable either. So um, he'll start taking the anti-inflammatory today and then I've got to take him to the vet 
one day soon before his medicine runs out to get blood work. Um, which that's kind of tough with Christmas, but we'll make it work. And um, let's see, what else? So today we are skipping the gym because we drove down there and his swim class got moved up from 11.30 to 10.45. So with running down there and back and all that, um, it's 9.20 right now. We're gonna get up there around 9.40, 9.30 and then I'll just let him play at the pool for a while beforehand um, and then we'll go home and have lunch and then it's nap time. So uh, we really didn't have time to fit the gym in this morning. So we'll just see where we go from here. You don't know how well you'll be able to hear me, but we are just hanging out in the pool. He has 45 minutes till his swim class because we got here kind of early. Uh, and they just turned the waterfall on. I'll show you that for him. He's, uh, he loves sitting here playing. So we're just hanging out here at the pool for a little while. And then I'll get ready to go into swim class because I take the class with him for his swim class. Ooh, did they turn on the waterfalls for you, MJ? Yeah. We just turned on all the waterfalls for him. He loves them. <laughs> you hear the music? They're doing a uh, another class over there. They teach water aerobic classes in here too. That's what the music is. Uh, today is kind of uneventful, honestly. We went to swim school and now we are home. Uh, MJ napped. It is 3.45 and we are going to his gymnastics class soon, but he's getting ready to play with some blocks. Uh, I took a shower while he was napping and taped a video. And here are the shoes I meant to show you guys from yesterday. These are the ones that I got. They're the Rag and Bone Newberry, the black ones. I got them in a nine and a half. And um, I'm so glad I went with these instead of the others. I think I might get these in brown too. I really like them. Because they're classic, they'll, go, they'll be in style for years. And um, you can wear them with something. You can dress them up a little bit by putting them with something dressy or you can dress them down. Um, they're very easy to work with. And um, it was just a pain in the butt to get them. So <laughs> it is what it is. Um, I'm really enjoying them so far. I just wore them around the house last night to make sure they were comfortable. And uh, we're pretty much, something stuck out on my deck. I have no idea what it is. So I'm gonna go check that out. And uh, we are pretty much after this going to gymnastics and then we have to go pick up my car at the dealership. And then we're gonna grab some dinner and come home and that's about it. Yeah, Woohoo! Uh, are you jumping? Uh, Bounce on your butt. You're a crazy bouncer. Stay in the middle, please. Let's go around the big way, you ready? All right, let's do it. Ready? Ready, feet. going to be a little busy so I'm not sure how much I'm gonna be able to catch up with you guys but happy Thursday my mom is coming over this morning and we are going to cook bake cookies our Christmas cookies that we do together every year and then 
I have to get ready and go to my company Christmas party at one o'clock today. Um, so right now I'm cutting up the cherries. I just pulled out all of the stuff we need to make the cookies and I'm cutting up some little cherries and having a cup of tea. And I am just in comfy clothes, um, pretty much one of those J. Crew baseball t-shirts and those pants. Oh my gosh, these are the most comfortable thing ever. They're those um, airy sweatpants. I don't know, I'll put a link below, but they are awesome. They're so comfy. Um, and I think that's it. So I will try and show you what I can as we can. And I'm doing laundry too. Crazy. Are you excited to make cookies? Make cookies. Cookies. With yeah. what? Are those sprinkles? Sprinkles. Sprinkles. Do you put them on the cookies and decorate? Grandmoms. Yeah, Grandmom's going to come and help us. Okay. Sit down, please. You don't stand up. Oh, you want another one? one? Okay. Open it. No, not right now. You wait for Grandmom. Wait, Grandmom? Well, I am off and running for my Christmas party. I was running a little bit behind between making the cookies, which I didn't get a chance to tape because we were kind of running behind with it. Um, I'll try and show you some of them later on tonight when I get home, but... We made the cookies and then Marty came home and we forgot we had to return the rental car because we got my car back last night. Um, so we have to return the rental car. So I had to go pick him up there, take him back home. And now I'm on the way to the Christmas party and it's 1220 and I have to be there at one. And it's probably about 45 minutes away and it's snowing. It's not sitting on the ground or anything, but it still makes everybody drive slower and you know, you should. But it is what it is, so I am heading that way, trying to think of what I have on. Um, I have on Lancome Nude Miracle, uh, Laura Mercier Minerals. Under my is the Bobbi Brown Tinted Eye Brightener. Um, let's think. Girl on Four Seasons Bronzer, Blushes Ill and Masca Naked Rose. Dior, I have a Dior Amber Diamond on my highlight. Lips are NARS Audacious in Barbara. Um, I'm gonna put some gloss on the Urban Decay Naked. I don't have it on right now. On my eyes is the Becca Ombre's Nude, uh, L'Oreal Hip Gel Liner, and the Laura Mercier Faux Lashes Mascara. And I think that's everything. My jacket, you can't really uh, tell, but my jacket I've had for a couple years and it's from a little boutique uh, in Cape Cod by our house there that I picked it up one year in the winter and I love it it's like got this like fluffy collar it has a whole bunch of them it goes all the way down <clears throat> and ruffles out and around um, I have on honestly a bunch of I've got on my rag and bone booties I've got on a pair of uh, tights I think they're from Gap they're like a, a zigzag um, I've got on a gray skirt that I've had for quite a few years that's got like a black belting and then it um, like almost flowers out at the top with a black top from Ann Taylor Loft and I have a cardigan on too, I have something on my nail. Um, so that's kind of my whole thing. I'll try and show you the whole outfit obviously. Uh, I was gonna wear the pants from White House Black Market but the shoes that I would wear with those are like a black, uh, they're BCBG stiletto with a steel heel and they're stilettos and it's snowing and I know they have valet parking at Fleming's where we're going but I also have to run a couple errands afterwards um, there's a J crew right there and an anthropology that I wanted to go in so I don't want to go walking out on the streets in a pair of steel heel stilettos in the snow so I wear my rag and bone booties um, and they go cute with this so uh, that is everything this is the funny part is I had this outfit laying out to take with me for the Christmas party on Saturday. This is what I planned on wearing there. So I might be flip-flopping them or I might just wear this outfit again. Uh, just wash the shirts tomorrow before we leave or tonight before we leave. So that's everything heading out now. I have an ambulance coming up behind me. Okay, he's turning the other way. Uh, so I am gonna head over to the Christmas party, get there as quick as I can. And, uh, oh, and we do a white elephant. Oh, he did decide to come this way. He decided not to turn. Um, we do a white elephant and in the white elephant we um, get different gifts and all that and I got uh, Marty and I well first of all my whole group of the realtors that work with me all 
are big drinkers and that is always the first gifts that get traded back and forth and so I got adult chocolate milk it's it's creepy it looks like an old-fashioned milk bottle um, it has alcohol in it but uh, that was funny and then uh, for their candy cane shot glasses so I thought that was funny too so you know it's only supposed to be a $20 like gag gift so that's what I went with and uh, I'm taking that and I'll show you guys whatever I end up with at the end too. Never would happen. Never would happen in our life. Never. Although I can wish you all a I usually call Friday evening and the day has totally gotten away from us because we got up got directly in the car pretty much just packed the car and went uh, drove up to Massachusetts took us a little bit longer today but it wasn't too bad we hit two accidents or we're stuck in two accidents of traffic um, got here around two o'clock uh, went out for a little bit came back home but it was like out we just went to test drive a car um, my mother-in-law has we were trying to decide if we liked her ML 350 and I think it's too small uh, for what I want but that is beside the point um, we did that and then I came back home and we've honestly just been hanging out here at the house um, I just got ready uh, threw on a sweater I've got on a Vince sweater and a pair of jeans are Hudson Nico skinny I think is what they're called um, on my face is Lancome Nude Miracle Laura Mercier Minerals Guerlain Too Faced Four Seasons, Illamasqua, Blush, Dior Amber Diamond. On my eyes is that Bare Minerals Top Shelf. I keep wanting to say True Shelf. Top Shelf uh, Shadow um, and lipstick is Nars Audacious in, not Barbara, the other one I got, like Anita, I think it is. Um, we're going out to dinner with, I just freshened up my hair from yesterday a little bit, threw a couple curls in. Uh, we are going out to dinner at a place called The Federal here in West Springfield, Massachusetts slash uh, Springfield, Chicopee area. So we are going to go to dinner there with some friends and catch up. We're here for a Christmas party this weekend um, here at Marty's parents' house. And uh, you might be able to see MJ's bed is behind me. I'm in, uh, I get ready in the room that he stays in. Um, and so I will try and show you guys what I can tonight and uh, thanks so much for watching guys I hope you're still enjoying these. Please let me know if you have any questions or suggestions and uh, I'll show you anything that we might have to do. You want to see? No, but we got like... Huh? Reminds me of Mama. I got that too. Yeah.